Well, we're full of confidence. Um, like you said, we've won those games. Uh, but not only have we won, we've, we've improved in our game. And that, uh, that gives us the confidence to, to feel that we can get a good result on, on Saturday. I think the Omaha game this past Tuesday was our best game of the year. Um, where we, we felt like we dominated the first half and we actually scored, which hasn't happened in some other games that we have dominated. And we kept, we kept a clean sheet. So um, we, we feel like we're improving and that's a good sign. So that gives us confidence for Saturday. Uh, well, recovery has been key. Recovery, uh, I think the, the coaching staff has done a great job of helping us recover for the games, feeling fresh. Uh, with, with the traveling and the, and the proximity of the games, you know, it's tough sometimes to, to get that energy back, get those legs under you, and, and I think that's, that's been key. Uh, you know, there's, there's been a little bit of twitches here and there tactically, um, but, but in terms of, uh, of really getting the, light, the guys get their rest and all that stuff, I think, I think that's been really important. Uh, and the mental part too, I mean, that's... that's uh, the credit has to go to the guys who recharge batteries mentally. It's not easy when you play every third day uh, with travel included, with getting results and the pressure of getting another result because you want to uh, get to the top of the table. Uh, so credit to the guys who have been uh, top notch mentally in this, in this stretch. Uh, I think the key is going to be to impose our game. That's what we, we've been doing very well in the last uh, in the last games, especially in the last two home games. We have, uh, I feel like we have dominated the game. We have controlled the game. We have created the, the better chances. Um, and uh, that's gonna be key. And the other one is uh, finishing our chances. You know, we, we feel like last game against Greenville, we had a very good first half. We created enough chances to go on the scoreboard and, and we didn't. And, uh, the second half, they, they uh, you know, adjusted a little bit, uh, made things harder for us, and scored scored a goal, which is how you win games, right? So, uh, imposing our game and finishing our chances is going to be is going to be the key. And um, really, I, I just try as a, as a in, in a leadership role that you talk about. I just try to, uh, I guess, set an example, right? How I prepare, how I handle myself in, in the locker room before the game, during the warm-up, during the game. Uh, you know, try to control the emotions, try to bring that energy, physical energy, mental energy, and try to, you know, bring the guys together. And, and, and that's about it. Then uh, when the team's together, things good things start happening. Um, I think the team is, is clicking very well together. And I mean, we've been prepping just like always. I feel like it's it's just a matter of time that we started winning. We've been we fight for each other and we just work for each other. Uh, we've been working very hard, and I feel like the team is finally clicking. We have so much energy, and we've been working extremely hard. And well, we play for. For each other, and we, we just want we just want to win so we can qualify for the championship. Um, for us, I feel like it's going it's going to be a tough game, and we have to grind it out and be patient and never give up. I feel like in all our games, we we went down in one of them and we never gave up, and we just we just want uh, the best for the team and the city and. We just have to work hard for our fans. Yeah, I think the entire group is super confident and uh, ready for the challenge on Saturday. And I think we're we're all just as excited too. You know, this is a long time coming, and I think this group feels we have something to prove to the league and ourselves and our fans. Um, and we just want to go out there and, and prove how good we are and how good we can be for this the final stretch following this game. And so, I think we're super confident. Uh, we know the level that we can play, and we're just we're just ready to prove it. Yeah, I think the biggest thing about preparation is, you know, your prep confidence comes through your preparation. And so we've just really been focusing on being ourselves and, and what job do we need to do on the day. And so 
you know, looking at the opponent a little bit, but then mostly looking at ourselves and kind of just constantly improving upon what we did last game and, and just taking baby steps and doing the small things right. And, and hopefully that accumulates into a win. And, you know, we've been fortunate these past couple games where it has, uh, but I think everyone is really prepared and come in really well and, and been super confident. I think that's the most important thing really. And then also just, there's been a, a huge will to win and, and grind out results. And, you know, I think one of the coolest things we've won in multiple ways these past games, you know, some haven't been so pretty, some have. And um, I think that's proved a lot to ourselves that, you know, we, we're winners and we can do it in multiple ways. And that gives us a, a silent confidence going into games. And so I, I think tomorrow's done nothing different and we're just going to go out there and try and prove ourselves. Yeah, I think the, the first thing is we, we need to play our game. I think it's proven to be successful and when we're confident and on top of the game, you know, we, we're playing our best. So I think that's that's the first thing is we just need to relax and play like it's every other game and have that confidence that I was talking about. And then, you know, I think other than that, I think we need to be ready for what Greenwood's going to throw at us and be able to adapt, um, you know, in a 90 minute match. That's what is most important and that's how you win games at this level is who's going to do their job the best, who's going to score more goals and who's going to be able to adapt to what the team's throwing against you. So I think for us it's just simplifying things and going back to what's made us successful in the past and then executing it on a higher level against a really good opponent uh, tomorrow. So uh, other than that, score some goals and keep the goals out and I think we'll, we'll do a really good job.